Hello readers, I'm Jessie Quinn from Cup of Books, and today we're talking about the crime thriller Out by Natsuyo Carino. This review is of the English translation of Out, which was translated by Steven Snyder. Out by Natsuyo Carino is a crime thriller that focuses on four women who work in a lunch packaging factory in Japan. When one of the women ends up killing her abusive husband, little do they know how this one event is going to drastically change their lives. Now I wouldn't say most of the characters in this book are likable, but they are still engaging in their complexity. Now there are some characters that I feel weren't as well developed as others. For instance, Kuniko, who is one of the four women, she is very much a stereotype of the ultimately greedy, selfish, superficial woman. I understand that she's there to comment on Japanese beauty standards and ageism in Japanese culture, but I would have liked to see her a little bit more developed as a person. But the other three women are very well developed, particularly Misako, who is arguably our leading lady. Her motives and her decisions are what drive most of the plot. And she's an incredibly complex character. She is also the one who becomes a sort of leader for these four women. She is not the one, however, who kills her husband. While she is very dissatisfied with her various roles in life, her role as a worker, her role as a mother, her role as a wife, those roles and her dissatisfaction with them do not define her. For the first hundred pages, I was convinced I knew where the story was headed and it felt very predictable and at times because it felt predictable it also felt like the pacing was dragging on and on. But about halfway through the book, this novel chooses to go in a completely different direction than what I had ever anticipated and that was when I really became engaged in the story. But then the last 50 pages happened and I was really torn because the ending is just such a drastic shift. I'm not sure I agree with where this story went. Now the narration style in this one is interesting because it often comes off as kind of detached. Masako in particular has this way of distancing herself from the situations around her and yet she is still very much engaged in what's happening and she's still a very compelling character. In fact her ability to view things so business-like makes her a really interesting character to follow. Now this novel is very violent and some of that sexual violence and at times I didn't really like the way the violence was discussed but other times it felt like it worked really well within the novel. Sometimes I read a book and I feel that the parts are stronger than the whole and I kind of feel that way about Out. There was enough that I really enjoyed like the characters and the middle plot and the discussions about different aspects of Japanese culture that were just so engaging that I can't really feel like I regret reading this one. It wasn't a negative read for me. But in terms of the whole plot, including the beginning, the middle, and of course the conclusion, I'm not sure it worked as well as I wanted it to. I think it would be really interesting to hear other people's opinions on this one to see whether we agree or disagree or maybe a little of both. But of course, as always, please don't post spoilers in the comment section of this video. If you want to talk to me about this book, feel free to find me on Tumblr or private message me on YouTube and we will chat spoilers.